in a time of trial, loss, worry, and disruption. We kept our bearings and never lost heart. It's been one of those turns in life when perseverance makes all the difference, when we had to show just how resilient we are. Now to some breaking news. 500,000 COVID-19 vaccines have now been administered at State Farm Stadium. It's like things have really ramped up. I've been at several vaccination sites and I've never seen one that's quite as busy as this one. So I think they're gonna be coming to you to look at how you did it because you're doing such a great job. The Arizona National Guard playing a pivotal role this past year during the pandemic. And today they have a new leader. Major General Carrie Muhlenbeck. She is the first woman to hold that role. Governor Doug Ducey declaring a state of emergency, saying he is sending 250 National Guard troops to the border. It's time for the Biden administration to act. Border security has been seen as something that the southern states have to deal with. To have 460 percent spike in illegal apprehensions, over 100,000 people in custody, 13,000 migrant children. This is a historic record for the agency, and it needs attention. Doug Ducey signed a $100 million wildfire relief bill. This puts us another step closer in protecting our communities around the state of Arizona. Thank you to all of our legislature for this successful special session. A very successful session in Arizona this year, the largest tax decrease in state history. Arizona has the lowest flat tax in the nation at 2.5%. The governor signing a bill today allowing community colleges to offer four-year college degrees. Today, I'm signing SB 1485. This bill is simple. It's all about election integrity. Now to that sports betting bill, Arizona officially becoming the latest state to make it legal. And today as tribal state partners, we cement this new chapter of tribal state gaming into Arizona state history. Today, Governor Doug Ducey signed the bill allowing bars, liquor stores, and other restaurants to sell cocktails to go. Today, Governor Ducey signed legislation expanding Holocaust education in Arizona schools. The governor also issuing a new executive order that bans vaccine passports here in Arizona. Water agencies from Arizona, Nevada, and California all agreed today to try and conserve 500,000 acre feet of water over the next two years. I'm honored today to sign HB 2454 a bill that is critical to the future of health care in Arizona. A bill the governor just signed that expands telemedicine statewide. Everybody knows the five C's of Arizona. I think you could add two additional C's. You've got chips, you've got electric cars. Today, Intel is announcing a new $20 billion investment, the largest private sector investment in Arizona history. If Arizonans are looking to this year with a feeling of accomplishment and optimism, it is because they've witnessed the strength of their fellow citizens.